plasma proteins plasma proteins include albumin globulin fibrinogen and prothrombin the total amount of plasma protein in the blood is 6.4 to 8.3 gram per cent and the normal albumin globulin ratio is 1.7 is to 1 and this ratio is reversed in case of liver disorders as the albumin synthesis is decreased in liver disease plasma pheresis or ripples experiment is an experimental procedure done in animals to demonstrate the importance of plasma proteins some of the functions of plasma proteins it is involved in the coagulation of the blood due to the presence of fibrinogen prothrombin and clotting factors it takes it takes part in coagulation of the blood it is involved in the defense mechanism of the body as gamma globulins uh, they are going to produce uh, antibodies they maintain colloidal osmotic pressure almost 80% of the colloidal osmotic pressure is due to the albumin and colloidal osmotic pressure is inversely proportional to the molecular size and directly related to the concentration of the molecule it is involved in the transport albumin and uh, globulin transports various hormones enzymes bilirubin and metals like copper uh, iron etc plasma proteins are very important for acid base uh, balance or regulation because of their buffering action it provides stability to the blood this is due to the presence of globulin and uh, fibrinogen if the blood lose viscosity rbc will pile upon each other and leads to role formation plasma proteins are important for maintenance of systemic arterial blood pressure uh, as uh, the viscosity of the blood is mostly due to the fibrinogen and arterial blood pressure depends on the viscosity of the blood and plasma proteins acts as a protein store so here are some of the uh, differences between albumin globulin fibrinogen and prothrombin the molecular weight of albumin is around 69000 the normal plasma level ranges between 3.5 to 5 gram per cent it is produced in the liver some of the important functions are binding and carrier protein acts as a binding and carrier protein and it is important for osmotic regulation globulin molecular weight is bit high it is between 90000 to 1.5 lakhs uh, its concentration ranges between 2 to 3 gram per cent it is produced by the reticular endothelial cells and plasma cells and it is important for mediation of immunity uh, and uh, it acts as a transport proteins uh, uh, for as a transferrin ceruloplasmin and hemopexin and uh, fibrinogen the molecular weight is around uh, 3.5 lakhs and its uh, plasma level ranges between 0.2 to 0.4 gram per cent it is produced in the liver and it is important clotting factor for the clotting of the blood and it provides uh, the major part of the viscosity to the blood where prothrombin the molecular weight is around 68000 concentration is 0.1 gram per cent it is also again produced in the liver it is important clotting factor in the blood hyperproteinemia increase in the level of plasma proteins is seen in conditions in which uh, there is a hemo concentration for example diabetes insipidus hypoproteinemia where the decreased levels of plasma protein is observed it is seen in malnutrition burns malabsorption and hemorrhages this causes decrease in colloidal osmotic pressure therefore increase the filtration uh, uh, filtration occurs at the arterial end and decrease in the absorption at the venous end occurs and this is going to result in edema in liver disorders ag ratio reverses when the body tissues are damaged though plasma albumin falls the plasma immunoglobulin increases as a result of plasma cell hyperplasia causing ag ratio reversal 
multiple myeloma where there is increase in the levels of global institute of the malignant growth of plasma cells.